Pippen with the recovery. Try to hit Cartwright, but Barkley alert was right there for the steal. And here, back to the live action. Barkley backs in, faces a double team. Dumas is open. Well, that time, uh, you had Richard Dumas guard Michael Jordan. And see, Richard Dumas is not used to running off of picks, and they set a pick on him. Dumas with a beautiful move. And the Suns want to make it a game six. Back in Phoenix on Sunday. Michael Jordan is two of three. Only gets down, so the Suns take advantage on the transition and lead 10-8. Michael, well, again, Mike, that wasn't uh, Michael Jordan fought that time because Marley's not guarding Michael Jordan. That was Scotty Pippen who was guarding Marley, and that was his fault. Dumas. Marley not given any room from three-point land. Miller. Barkley. Charles getting the good possession. In fact, he himself says he feels his contribution has been zero. Early entrance, though, for McRae. Barkley getting Pippen or McRae. Doesn't matter. Right now, they just switch back and put McRae on Barkley. Then Pippen ran over to take Barkley. Jordan. Barkley gets to it. mentioned coming out of the timeout that Chicago went with McCray over King. A nice backdoor pass by Charles Barkley to Danny Ainge. Oh, Magic, you mentioned the Suns regular season philosophy. They average 113 per game, leading the NBA, second in shooting it at 49 percent. Here's Chambers. Yes, a two-point Chicago lead. Uh, in the game, in game three, because they were pushing the ball up early, and they're trying to do that again. Barkley with the steal. Well, Charles had that diagnosed, and he's tying the game at 35. And then Charles showed Michael that he wants to play in this game as well. The best for a guy his size that's stepping up in the passing lane and then taking it the length of the floor. Now they double up on Johnson. Miller had to save it. The trapping of the Bulls paying dividends here. West for Barkley, and he's fouled by Williams. That will fake you, get you to run, and then they'll thread the needle in the heart of the defense. They trap Johnson. Help from Dumas. Chambers picked up by Pippen. Chambers shooting. Barkley keeps it alive. Jordan. Rebounded by Barkley. Three and a half left. First half. Bulls by nine. Strong power move by Charles Barkley. Barkley posting up, reading the defense. Everybody is staying at home for Chicago until the last second. Paxson's going to try and come late to double team, but it's too late. You can't let Charles get this close to the basket. He splits him and scores. The other guy in Horace Grant, he blocks shots and grabs all the defensive boards. Nice pass. Barkley fouled. So Barkley to the line. He's one of two. From the line. Suns now 8 of 10 from the foul line. Bulls 7 of 9. Both clubs have shot well. Bulls at 59% from the field. Phoenix just under 50. I think this is more important for Phoenix in these last two minutes and 26 seconds than it is for Chicago. They came three on Sunday in the first half. The Bulls one for one from the foul line. So a different story here tonight. Bulls by eight. Charles Barkley hearing it from the crowd as he backs his way. Now here's a three attack by Marley. And Dan Marley did get the good look. And Michael Sooner, you let him get inside the foul line area. You know he's going to... He has 13 field goals. That is one field goal away. The only thing Michael does... Michael hasn't done in the first half is come up with a steal and knock down a at the stadium the new building still under construction just across the street will be open for business Barkley from Marley out of three Jordan and Barkley with the rebound pops it down Dumas ahead of the field able to elude Jordan the Barkley gets the ball goes after the rebound turns and sees two teammates down there 
Michael can't decide which guy he's going to throw it to at first. He goes all the way to Dumas for the score. That uh, you felt it was wrong for Michael Jordan. And here's another look at Barkley and uh, Pippen having words at close range. You thought it was wrong during the series for Barkley and Jordan, who are friendly, to have dinner, spend that much time together. Williams called for the foul. Oh, he's paying for it. Barkley hits one out of two. Yeah, we will get five, and the same thing, BJ for a three. And the same thing that the, he's doing with the New York Knicks. And you see Michael Jordan is able to drive here in this series anytime he wants to. All right, Miller. Last time he got a rebound, dribbled the length of the floor, made the pass. He's using up a lot more energy tonight. We'll see if it has its effects in the fourth quarter. Barkley backing Williams. Barkley 7 of 9, where the people in the arena and some of the countries may not have Armstrong. Barkley rebound. Jordan. And a foul is called as Barkley took a shot. Going on, and like I said, you have to have... Phoenix medical staff making the point if this were a regular season game, Charles probably would have sat it out. Now, why do you make a, a foul like this? For what? You, you, you don't want to stop the clock. If you Chicago and also stop the clock, which is in favor of the of Phoenix Suns. In the regular season, they were 75 percent. King for Jordan. Barkley rebound. Seven. Frank Johnson giving the shot. Phil Jackson rather uh, would rather take a chance with Scott Williams picking up a sixth than Horace Grant. Here's Johnson. Yes, Kevin Johnson. Paul Westfall was upset about as he felt that when Kevin Johnson went to the basket, they were riding him out on the hip, and that's the reason he didn't finish the play. It counts in the foul. Charles Barkley will go to the line. Barkley's gonna feel Williams and he's gonna spin on him, but then he's gonna dunk it right over Scottie Pippen. You talking about a strong man going to the hole. Pippen is rejected by Barkley. Knocked out of bounds by Ainge. What a play by Jordan, who was able to elevate, extend in the air as he made certainty of someone to pass the ball to. And then somebody just happened to be Scotty Pippen, and the guy that just happened to block the shot happened to be Charles Barkley, who, going back in the game earlier, had a few words for one another when there was some bumping and shoving going on, and Charles reminded him once again that that was me that got that block. So 3.35 remaining in this fourth quarter. The Bulls 100, the Suns 94 as Charles and Scotty get together. Phoenix 98. Now Barkley backing Grant, who's playing with five. Nice move by Charles Barkley. Rebound Marley. Fires for three. Rebound Barkley. And that's a goal turn. The basket will count. Johnson eluding Armstrong, finding Barkley, and the Suns move within two. With the last two times down, this time he's going to find an open man in Barkley for the slam dunk. Jordan, double team, and Barkley with the steal.